So welcome to a special daily wrap-up of the athletics program at the Special Olympics Asia Pacific Games. Dotty, that's day one done here at the Hunter Sports Centre. Uh, mate, how was it for you? It was a great day today. Uh, last night we were up late at the opening ceremony, plenty happening there, and we thought, could we get better? Well, I think we did out at the track today, Robbo. Plenty of action. We had uh, 100 metres, 200 metres, 400 metres, 800 metres, people throwing big shot puts, jumping in the long jump pit. It was action everywhere. Yeah, it certainly was. And look, it all kicked off with the 5,000 metres, and wasn't that great to see a couple of our Aussie homegrown talents out there. And we've had some medals today as well. Uh, some presentations, gold, silver, bronze. Aussies have been in the thick of it, but it's just been great to see the enthusiasm. Teams like India and Samoa, how good have they been? They've been fantastic. What's really struck me, Robo, is the interaction between the Australian and the Samoan support group. They're getting in there, they're high-fiving each other, they're down on what we call the rail, where they're cheering, bringing the runners home, and I really like that interaction. Yeah, today was High Five Monday, and that's the tradition here at the uh, Asia-Pacific Games. What have we got in store for us tomorrow, Dottie? Can you leak anything? I'd prefer not to leak anything, Robbo. I'd prefer for people to come back tomorrow and find out what follows on from High Five Monday. All right, well, excellent. Well, we'll be here tomorrow. We're here all week. Come down to the athletics. They're already calling it the best venue and the best event of the Newcastle Special Olympic Asia Pacific Games. Come down. Dottie and I will give you a personal high five. We'll see you here. Okay, over and out. Well.